Wall Street Memes Casino. I'm fine. And Sportsbook. Andrew McCart, IFL TV. I'm with the big man himself, Sean Lazzarini. Sean, I spoke to you maybe a month ago at Billy Nelson's Gem. You were saying, it's happening this year, it's happening this year. You've got two fights now, lined up, March and April. You must be buzzing, big man. Mm -hmm. Absolutely buzzing. Uh, so, I, obviously I said before that I want to get, um, have a really busy year. So, fight here, um, I fight in the St Andrews show, MLS Arena, Weatherspoons, outside of it, I don't mind, anywhere. Well, if you're on Weatherspoons, I'm going to be there. Um, but like I say, you're finally making your pro debut, it's been a long awaited pro debut. For people that don't know who Sean Lazzarini, you were a Commonwealth Games gold medalist. Now when you came out them, them Commonwealth Games, the whole of Scotland was excited because we had Tyler Jolly, we had Mike McHale, we had Sean Lazzarini, we had all these guys coming through and we're like, listen, this is going to be a, the, the, the golden era of Scottish boxing. But you all just took a little bit of time, but you're finally there. So pro debut, with the amateur career you've got, I'm going to just hazard a guess you're going to jump straight into the sixth round. There's no point you waiting around, is there? Yeah, 100%. I do eight renders or ten renders right now. Uh, I train really hard, so you'll never see me unfit. And But I think we're going to be doing six renders at the start. And uh, looking forward to it. I can't wait. Sure, the thing is, Tyler Jolly was up there and he sort of thanked Willie Lemon for sticking around and putting the gloves on so we can get these arena shows. Now, we need more of Willie Lemons. We need another Willie Lemons. We need another Ricky Burns. We need another Josh Taylor. Because yeah, yeah. unless Josh Taylor comes to town, no arena shows are happening. Unless Willie Lemon stays around, doesn't retire, there's no arena shows happening. So we need another Willie Lemon, Josh Taylor. Maybe even maybe not them, because a lot of fighters say I'm, I'm my own person. But are you that next guy coming out of Scotland that can sell these arenas that we're so desperate in need of in Scotland? I want, uh, in the future, I want to be selling out massive arenas. I know it's obviously a, a big thing to say just now starting off your career but you need to have that visualisation you need to visualise it you need to believe it achieve it and become it you know what I mean so um, that's what I plan to do I plan to be I plan to take on big names take out big names in the future I plan to have big events big massive nights bring big nights to Glasgow and um, yeah I don't want to say I do it for Scotland but I'm, obviously I'm Scottish I'm proud to be Scottish but I'm doing it for myself massively I've got a lot proved, a lot, a lot to prove to myself do you know what I mean and um, I'm just I can I'm so excited to start. I mean, you know me. You know me from a long time now, so I'm chomping at the bit to get started, and I'm going to just be grab this opportunity with both hands, and I'm not going to stop until that I'm satisfied, and I'm never satisfied, so I'm never going to stop. So, so you're going to be the next Willie Lemon in terms of fighting until you're 45. You never know. Well, look at Arthur Bitterbeev. Depends how well you look after yourself. Um, you can like keep going in the sport. So, and I'm not a drinker. I'm not a party animal. Uh, so. I plan to be an athlete like for my whole life, why not? That's, yeah. nice. That's wise words and something that a lot of people, yeah. young kids, especially your age, should really yeah. thrive, be aspired to because, again, the, the lifestyle in Scotland, our fighters and our football yeah, players, yeah. they do, do, do delve to that kitchen party, do you know what I mean? We need more athletes to stay athletes and yeah. fulfil their potential and that's, that's very wide words and if you keep that mentality, I mean, this boxing game, I mean, like I say, the world's your oyster. Yeah, 100%. It's a shame because, uh, especially in Glasgow as well, do you know, it's like, um, it's like there's such a massive culture for people becoming just party animals and drinking and stuff. And people think it's normal to just to take drugs and that these days. But I don't think it should be. Why? What's, what's wrong with looking after yourself? You're deemed a weirdo these days if you, if you don't want to get drunk and party. And, uh, and um, yeah, so it's like you look after yourself. Look, at pe look up to people like these guys like Arthur Bitterbeev. Canelo, these kind of guys, so they look after the boys. Bernard Hopkins, mm. you know what I mean? Look at him, he's so fit for his age. These are the kind of guys that I respect and look up to. You've got two fights lined up, like I said to you there, and that's very wise words, man, I'm going to clip that. Um, you got two fights lined up, March and April, I yeah. believe, right? So, back to back, what's going to happen? I mean, your pro debut is much anticipated. If you don't know Sean Lazzarini, go on, go on YouTube, look at some of his amateur fights. You've got flair, you've got power. You showboat a little bit. You've got everything that puts fans on yeah, the yeah. seats and puts them on the edge of the seats. Yeah. So you're a very exciting fighter. So speak to me. What's going to happen this pro debut? I'll be putting fans on the edge of the seats and putting opponents on their ass. <laughs> That's what I'll be doing. So like, people always just they, they say it, they, they think oh, I'm just a puncher and that stuff. But this light like heavyweight, everyone's a puncher. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? It's a big weight or super middleweight, the big weights. Um, you need to be a smart boxer as well. I, I plan on just developing my IQ, being a really technical boxer, which I am already. But I keep wanting to like, I'm always on a, I'm on this journey. There's no, never going to be the completed result. I'm just on a journey to keep getting better and better and better and better every single day. Um, with Billy Nelson now, and uh, 
He's got so much experience. I trained alongside Martin Bacoli, Lewis Crocker, um, Luke Bibby, Sultan Zobek. These guys, they're very... I just soak up these experiences and I learn from everybody. You can learn something from everyone in boxing. And uh, I'm a student of the game. I'm learning the sweet science and I want a degree in it. <laughs> I can't wait to see your pro debut. I'm looking forward to it. And a big year for you, Sean, oh, yeah, because you're an exciting good. fighter. And as a biased jock that I am, I want to see every single Scottish fighter do well. And you're one of them. Listen, brother, well done. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you, Sean. Wall Street Memes Casino. I'm fine. And Sportsbook.